Treasure is hidden in the Rockies by a crafty millionaire. And tonight, we could be one step closer to finding it. Denver 7's Jason Grenauer is on the hunt. Bill Chapman lives for this sound. I treasure hunt. It's right at the surface. For decades, he's chased relics all across the country. All over. It's the thrill of the hunt. It's not necessarily the find. That's a treasure. He also believes the legendary tale of Forrest Fenn. It is of significant value. More than a million dollars worth of treasure that the New Mexico antique dealer allegedly hid somewhere in the Rockies and remains hidden to this day. I think we've narrowed it down to about four states. The only clues are from a cryptic poem. Solve the clues, solve the mystery, look for the treasure. But the idea of the proverbial needle in a haystack had some people pretty skeptical. I don't know. Does it really exist? No one's been able to find it. Sounds like a, a story, a made up story. But some were sold. Oh, it's real. I mean, I've seen the guy on TV. I believe him. One treasure hunter even died chasing Fenn's prize last year. So others have now banded together their clues on a new website to try to get one step closer. It will be found eventually. Somebody is going to find it. Reporting somewhere in the Rocky Mountains, I'm Jason <laughs> Grenauer, Denver 7. And if you feel up to joining the hunt, we've got a link to the map on the Denver 7 app, and you can search words or phrases from that poem to see what others have discovered or dead ends they found in search of the treasure. And if you need Jason, yeah, he's up somewhere <laughs> in the Rocky Mountains.